So, recently, I've been in like a really creative rut. I've had like a proper creative block, either or, whichever you prefer to call it. Whether it was coming to YouTube or my photography work, because I have client work on the side, anything creative, I just had a mental block against. Every time I thought about doing something creative, I just couldn't be asked, pretty much. And then anything I did make, I just wasn't happy with, it just didn't turn out how I expected it to, it just, nothing worked. And then when I'm not creating things, it gets me down, so I've been down, it's just not been a good time. But then I started looking at more into fashion, and using fashion as a creative outlet. Which is something that I thought I did before, but now I really think about it, it wasn't, wasn't really that creative. But recently I've been looking at more ex like expressive fashion and just different ways to wear clothes. I've completely changed my wardrobe, everything I wear now is completely different to what I used to wear. And to be honest, it's actually really helped. It's helped me get out of my creative rut. It's helped me, it's helped me feel inspired to make stuff again. And it's even helped me pick up the camera and do this again. I just really want to make a conscious effort to work more on being creative. I've been watching a lot of fashion people on YouTube, been using Pinterest a lot more for my fashion and stuff. And then, really, that brings us to now. Welcome back. We made it two videos in, and then I lost the motivation again. Two videos! But I just thought I'd make this video quickly just to give you an update on where my head's at, where I'm at, where the channel's at. So obviously, like I said, I've been getting more into my fashion, experimenting more with different stuff and just wearing different clothes to what I'd usually wear. I've also been doing photography client work. That's pretty much just being like a, a freelance photographer sort of thing. I also dropped out of uni. <laughs> Lasted two years at uni and then sacked it off pretty much. It just wasn't for me. It just wasn't for me. It's for some people, but it's just, it's just one of them. And I've also done something that I've been wanting to do for a few years, which is actually set up a Depop shop. I've set it up. That's essentially as far as I've got. Well, no, I've put, I have posted a few items, but it hasn't necessarily picked up yet. But it's, it's slow in the beginning. If you want to check that out, I'll have a thing there and the link in the description. I'm also going to be doing like Depop videos and like charity shop, thrift shop finds and stuff like that. At the minute, I've still got some client work to finish off. I've got a few shoots in the pipeline, but I'm really wanting to get this channel back up and going again. Obviously, not necessarily bike content, but more... <laughs> I'm having deja vu from the last video I made about this. But more photography, fashion-esque videos, styling videos, shopping videos, or whatever comes into my head. I want to stop overthinking it and just make it rather than think it has to be like a 10 minute video. Every cut has to be perfect, every transition's got to be bang on. I'm just going to make stuff and upload it and just do what I want to make rather than just overthinking all these scenarios. But yeah, <laughs> I just thought I'd pick up the camera and uh, thank everyone for sticking around. It <laughs> honestly means a lot more than you think. And I want to apologise as well, just for being sort of all over the place. So I built up this little community and then just sort of left, <laughs> sort of left it. So just as a recap, I want to say thank you and I also want to apologise and I'm hopefully going to be churning out videos, maybe not churning them out, maybe one a week, two a week, something along just to let it pick up again. Fashion videos, style videos, photography sort of videos, just sort of chatting videos like this, just easy watching videos. That's the vibe I'm wanting for this channel. We'll see how far we get this time. I know this has only been a quick one, but I just wanted to get this up and sort of give you an idea of what's going through my head and what I'm wanting to make and what you can sort of expect on the channel in the future. So yeah. <laughs> so let me know what you think down there, as you usually do. Still getting comments to this day and it's amazing. I haven't been able to reply to anything as of yet because I've just been packed, just working, doing the client shoot. But I've got a new camera, so let's keep it going. Rebranding coming in one week. <laughs>